Hello friends, uh, we have a uh, batch reactor problem. Uh, second order kinetic reaction A equals B takes place in a batch reactor with a kinetic rate constant K is equal to 0.2 moles per second per cm cube inverse. So initial concentration of component A is given as a CA0 is equal to 2 moles per cm cube. Find out outlet concentration CA after 5 seconds using ODE45 solver. Also plot a graph of concentration of A versus time. So we have this uh, uh, modeling equation that is dCA by dt is equal to minus k star c a square. Now same equations uh, equation we have solved by analytically and we have you can see here uh, we integrate this equation by putting the proper limits and uh, by putting the value of t as a uh, time t is equal to 5 second we have the concentration of a 0 0.667 moles per dm cube. Now same problem we are we will solve by using uh, OD solver in MATLAB. So for that we will open the MATLAB software by clicking on this icon. It will open and we'll have this uh, windows so this is a command window current current folder workspace now uh, this command window will execute the results and we are going to write our program in a script file there are two different types of script file one is a function file other is a, a script file or a data file so we are going to write the equation or the function in function file and rest of the things in the editor file. So here it will start from the command that is clear all, close all. This can be used to remove the previous variables we have assumed. Then uh, as we have to solve the ordinary differential equation, the best way to solve any uh, software is by using a simple uh, command that is f1 that means help so similarly as we have to solve that equation by that is ordinary differential equation we can take the help of um, this command that is ode45 by putting on that there is a different um, helps we are uh, obtained so we will we, we'll use ode45 command and the syntax is provided different syntax is provided here and we will use one of the syntax here. Now we will use this first one that is t comma y od45 comma t comma s yes, uh, t comma uh, t span y0. So od is fun is nothing but the function file. od45 is a solver. t span is a time and y0 is nothing but the concentration initial concentration of the dependent variable. Now we will see how to solve by using MATLAB. So here we'll use that command that is t, t c equals to od45. So here as we uh, type ODE45, it helps us how to write that syntax. So here we have to write ODE function file. So we will give the name that is batch reactor fun. Fun means function file. So before that we have to write here semicolon single inverted comma then we have to write T span then initial concentration that is C0. Now uh, before writing this here the syntax we have to write we have to provide all this T span and C0 that is initial concentration or initial values. So before that we give that values that is T span or uh, C0 we will give first of all C0 C0 
equals to that is 2 which is already provided then we will write a t span that is 0 as to we will take a step size of 0 0.5 and we have to find out the concentration for 5 second so that's why 5 then this is the syntax now we will have to uh, plot the graph also so we will write for it for that uh, plotting the graph that is the command plot that is plot of t comma c then we will also uh, give the title to that plot title concentration versus time then we will uh, we'll give x level that is a name for x axis on x axis it is time time in second on y axis it is y level we have concentration mole per cm cube now we can give the legend legend c a it's concentration of a right now here here we have uh, changed that we have to write the title as t i t l e e now you can we can save this file by giving any name there is batch reactor so this is nothing but the uh, initial concentration as there is only one uh, there is only one uh, variable that's why we can give only one initial values initial values And after that, uh, by giving this percentage sign, this uh, this this will not play any role in the uh, program. This will only give information, and this is nothing but the syntax. Syntax for ODA solver. Okay. Now, after giving, we can solve any uh, differential equation by using the same. Uh, uh, file. Now we have to give the function and function file start with the name function dctt as we have to solve that dctt as we have given the name function file that is batch reactor fun so same name we have to provide here also If the name will be different, then the program will not run. T comma C. Okay. Now after giving this, we have to give the function. So that is DC DT is equals to in square bracket. We have to give that equation. Uh, we have only one function that is uh, minus k c square. So we'll give that equation here. That is minus k star c now instead of a we'll give the 8 as a because it is a matrix matlab is nothing but the matrix so we'll give that uh, matrix in the form of matrix array 
so here there are uh, c square so either we can write uh, k star c1 star c1 or you can give the this uh, it's square now you close that equation now here we have to provide k value before this equation where k is nothing but 0 0.2 now you we can, and this this function file will save automatically whatever the name we have supplied here and we have to we, we will not change this file name see here it's auto, automatically take the name batch reactor fun so we have only one equation so in this square bracket we will provide only one equation if there may be multiple equations then we have to give the multiple uh, equations here also now here uh, we have to run the uh, this program by clicking on this run command and here we got the plot also right so here what uh, we want we want our uh, problem uh, objective is find out the concentration after uh, concentration of uh, a after 5 seconds so this is the uh, value now we can uh, get that value how much uh, how we can identify this uh, this is a function or this is a value that is 0 0.667 is the concentration after 5 seconds so that uh, here we can also add one uh, line here that is results equal to and here we can put time and c so this vector and after whatever we uh, make a change we have to save it and after saving it then we can uh, then then only that the change will uh, execute in the function then again we can run this command we will have see here we got the plot and also we have this uh, equation that is uh, this results that means this this is a time vector and this is a concentration vector so after five, five seconds we have this uh, value And also we have this uh, figure function from this figure function we can uh, see here the name of the this title of this graph is concentration versus time uh, on y-axis concentration and concentration in moles per cm cube uh, x-axis is also given and this legend for this is c in this way we can uh, have this uh, graph also graph value now uh, as we can uh, this uh, as we change the con initial concentration or time uh, time span right we can easily ch see the change in equation or in in graph also so this is the beauty of this software that we can make uh, or you can have the uh, concentration for uh, having a uh, multiple of, uh, multiple of time so here we have uh, calculated for 5 second you can calculate it uh, up to 100 seconds also just by just by um, changing that five in terms of uh, instead of 100 and saving it and you can see the effect so we will have the concentration of a after 100 seconds and we'll have that same graph like this so this is the beauty of the software thank you